we've already left Yuming and uh, have entered the Mongolian Autonomous Prefecture of Bortala. And right now, we're heading towards La Funko, which is about a four hour drive away from here and is southwest of Yuming. But uh, we've got some very nice scenery to keep us company. To be honest, Bortala looks exactly how I pictured Mongolian life on the plains. Wow, lots and lots of wind turbines to greet us. It's probably because we're very, very close to Alashanko now and it's a very windy place. But to me, it's like they're greeting us. It's like you're saying, hello, welcome to Alashanko. Alashanko is one of Xinjiang's three major land ports, and although ports aren't usually at the top of my to-visit list, this place is an exception. Come this way, look at this place. It's very beautiful. Yeah, it yeah, is. There's, 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 a, there's a big map of China oh, on the bottom. Uh, China's map on the land. Look at It's very interesting. Oh, uh, so I guess this oh, well, is... Uh, make the white stone. Ah, yeah. so th this, is, this is still China, I Yeah, guess. yeah, that's right, yeah. Which part of China is this? Portal area. Yeah. So where is, where is Kazakhstan, then? Kazakhstan comes this way. Oh, this way? Yeah. Okay. Oh, so this is... Yeah. This is Kazakhstan? Kazakhstan yeah, that's that's right, amazing! Yeah. So it's literally right in front of us. Yeah, 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 that's right. This and is the Kazakhstan town. Yeah, what is, the, what is that town called? Dostuk. 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 Oh, how do, you say, how do you say hello in Kazakh? Selim Oh, God. No. <laughs> do you hear that? <laughs> hello, Kazakhstan! Yeah, that's an idea. Very good. Alashanko is the second biggest land port in China. Bordering Kazakhstan, it's also Xinjiang's only port of entry by rail. 90% of Xinjiang's imports and exports pass through here, most of them being natural resources. But even before the advent of trains, trade had already flourished for hundreds of years. You know, Alashanko is a part of something called the Zongarian Gate, which was a very important historical gateway from China Central Asia. It actually was used on the old Silk Road, but whereas before they had cattle, now we've got trains coming in. And it's really cool because some people can call this This is what I'm talking about. This is the life. You know, there's nothing better than being a uh, temporary shepherd for who's ever flock this is. But this is what I like about Xinjiang. You've got this kind of natural scenery, and you've got the most natural occupation for people here. <laughs> That's, uh, that's really not good. By the way, uh, let me introduce you guys to our crew. Hello, guys. <laughs> Say hello to the camera. <laughs> Since we, we have some problems. Yeah, we might just have not a bit. really seriously. <laughs> It will be fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. There we go. Back on the road. Just to let you know, roads between better known places in Xinjiang are fine, but when you're here in the borderlands, conditions aren't as great. You'll probably run into a few hiccups along the way, but there's no need to worry. We took the fastest route out of Alashanko, and two hours later, we've arrived in Wenchuan County, and the site of its biggest attraction, the Prairie Graveyards. It's believed these gravestones mark the last resting place of nomads who lived 500 years before the birth of Christ. Not much is known about them, 
or why they're all here. But I get the feeling that with these kinds of surroundings, perhaps their ancestors thought they found Shangri-La. Close by is something even more ancient. In this area nestled between Xinjiang and Kazakhstan is the Baini Nature Reserve. And it's home to a very special creature. It's like lots and lots of fish in a, a sack of jelly. It's, 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 it was all very wobbly, like, um, like gelatinous. <laughs> We're looking for Baini the endangered Central Asian salamander that live in the mountains around the Tsongarian Gate. It's just a, um, a waiting game now, then. The lovely lady over there is trying to find some baby to show us. Oh, this is the elusive baby, and uh, quite a beautiful little creature, really. Kind of like a... Um, Kind of like a frog, isn't it? This is the lovely little thing that has been around since. Oh, wow, that's an even bigger one. This is uh, pretty awesome. So these guys have been around since the dinosaurs. Have outlived so many animals that have gone extinct and still to this day survive right here in the heart of Xinjiang. Ha ha. Unfortunately, the nature reserve isn't open to tourists, but you can visit a dedicated Baini museum in Wenchuan Tao. Wenchuan actually means hot springs, so it's no surprise there are a lot of them here. Many people come for their therapeutic benefits, often staying for several days at the handy accommodation nearby. But as for us, we only have the time to admire this incredible scenery on our way to our next destination.